Hello everyone, this is Oasis from TV Zone, and today I will be showing you how to set up your IPTV for your smart TV. So the first step is to go to your app store. On LG, I believe it is called the LG Content Store, and on Samsung, it is called the Smart Hub. So once you select that, just wait for it to load. And in the top right hand corner, you'll see that search bar. So please just go ahead and search for Smart STB. Now I already have this installed on my on my TV, so I will get it up and running fairly quickly. Uh, it might take a little bit longer for you, but uh, overall it's not that long. So once you select the app, this part's really important. You'll get this screen, and then after this screen, you have to press OK right away. So I pressed OK. If you miss it, you might have to uh, restart the app because it won't take you to the correct screen, which is the one that you see here. Uh, from here, you select System Settings and then Device Info. And now on this page, you'll get pretty much all the information that you need uh, to set up your, your IPTV. You have the software MAC address, which you need to make a note of because we need that in a later section. And then you also have the virtual MAC address, which always starts with 001A79. And that's the MAC address that you need to uh, give to your IPTV provider. So once you've made a note of that, we're going to go ahead and go to the next step. Uh, please open up your web browser. And what you need to type in is uh, Smart STB. And then head to their website. Now you have three options here. There's a seven day free trial which if you scroll down, you'll just see access to it right there. Or you can pay $2.70 $2 US per month, which is roughly three fifty-five Canadian. Or you can pay a one-time lifetime fee of $27 US, which is roughly $35 Canadian. So uh, just choose whatever uh, package suits your needs best, and then go on to the next step. So under the TV MAC address is where you put the system MAC address, which you should have made made note of uh, in the earlier stages of this video. Uh, the one that I'm putting in is a, a fake one because I don't want to share my own personal uh, TV MAC address, but just make sure you put the correct one there. And under portal URL, uh, please put this uh, URL down. And since I already have this set up, I'm not going to go to the next stages, but just hit continue and then go to the checkout for you to get activation. Now, please head back to your TV and go into portals. And here you can choose to name your portal name TV Zone if that's the service that you're using, or if you're using Express, you might want to name it Express. And under portal URL, uh, you put down the same URL that you put down on the website. Once that's done, I just press back and then you'll see the TV Zone portal over there and just select that. And then just give it a few moments to load for you. And there you have it. Now you have access to TVs on IPTV with over 3,500 different channels, 9,000 movies, all live sports events, and many international categories. If for whatever reason uh, this process does not work for you, most likely what you'll have to do is contact uh, the Smart STB support and uh, see if they could help you troubleshoot the issue. Because on our end, it should be all good. Thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed the video.